Well, hey everybody. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Poconastic, starring me, Poconastic. In today's episode, we're gonna do something a little different. People always be like, Poconastic, why are you so cheap? You're going to Target, you're buying some cheap shit here. Well, what kind of channel is this, man? Well, why don't you open some booster boxes? We got the booster box of MetaZoo Wilderness. This, that's okay. This is gonna be super cool because it's a booster box and there's a whole bunch of stuff in it. So with this, we're actually hoping to open the Wild 7. That's what it's called, the Wild 7, or like the seven top chase cards that you can get. And just going off the top of my head, those chase cards would be the Stone Man, <laughs> the, the Michi Pichu, which you could just call Machu Pichu, uh, the Bigfoot, Bigfoot's the one I'm hoping we actually pull this one, like the foil version, where you know Bigfoot's super cool, AKA Sasquatch. Let's see, there's another one called Snap, He's like a yellow guy. I'm going to post all these right here, as you can see. And then we got another one called uh, Dragon of Uncanto Falls. Not Encanto, like with Maribel and Louisa, but Uncanto, like as in the cryptid. Or a beastie, as some might say. And then we also have the Prism Aurora. And this, or Prism Aura, probably that's the one you want to call it. Um, that one's super cool because it's like a star in the middle and it's kind of like a small star and stars are always cool and then behind it is like a cool giant foil and you know we like foils we like shiny things it makes us happy and that's what we're gonna go for and then here's what's super cool so here's what we're really hoping to get in this box there's actually 100 serialized cards called green man yeah green man and that they only made a hundred of them and it's like the super rare chase card that's like the big one there's only been like a few of them that have been pulled so there's plenty of out there left in the wild or in the wilderness as you could say but since we got a big box that's what she said we're gonna go jump on in and start cracking some packs of metazoo some some boozy lemonade it's disgusting Okay, here we go. We're going to use my trusty knife to open up this pack of MetaZoo Wilderness, this cool booster box. First edition. We get the seal of approval right here, security seal. Yeah, we got the snipe and the Bigfoot right there. Here we go. We ain't do no card tricks here like some channels because we're just gonna open it how it's intended. Okay, we got a reverse foil night marchers. Chibi Bigfoot. Okay, and then the tokens. Pack two. It's a cool card. Phantom car. See a fountain of youth. Reverse foil. So I've been watching a whole bunch of cool MetaZoo videos uh, the past couple weeks. It's interesting because everyone has their own takes on the events that occurred in late January on Mike Waddell on uh, Discord. And everyone has all these long videos about it, but it's like everyone just has the same information. There's just one little, one little post on a Discord and then it was taken down saying MetaZoo ain't around no more. But we'll see. Okay, look at that. We got a Chibi Bigfoot in a foil. I think that's a good pull. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Yeah, it was just interesting, like I was saying. Everyone just has their own takes on it. Some people were saying they... I was talking to ex-employees. And, like, like, sure, they know all the employees that used to work there. And they're all just shooting the shit. It's a lot of gossip, I hear. 
But you know, people like gossiping never stops. We'll see what happens. Time will tell. I hope something happens with the IP. I hope it continues, but if not, or especially even if not, there's so much to go back on and there's so much to collect that there's years of collections ahead of us. Wait, did we? Oh, okay, that was a reverse foil. I almost missed it because you can barely tell. There was another guy that I was watching too that he was actually dressed like an alien. In his channel, he's just like a regular guy, but he just dresses like an alien and talks about MetaZoo. So, you know, a lot of, a lot of different kind of channels out there. He's not one of them that was talking shit, but I'm just saying there's a lot of people that were. Let's see, ooh, this reverse foil jellyfish. Okay. Okay, so far we only got one full foil, but it was an awesome one. We'll keep going. Ah, a shovel. Ooh, spirit veil. Heat wave. Oh, here, I was just talking about that, and look at that. Look at that foil. The sparkling, no, the kindling spark root. Kindling spark root, that's a great one. Well, like I said, there's so much different variety and different cards to collect that you got years ahead of collection. Like even Wilderness, it's just not Wilderness, is Wilderness. There's like the big box edition. There's, what else is there? All right. There's like pins. I don't know. There's a whole bunch of stuff, guys. I don't know. There's just a lot. Skateboards, Bear Walker. Oh, look at that. Golden Haired Girl. Another foil. A rare one. Hell yeah. Okay, Snow Goyster. Reverse. Here we go, just adjusting a little bit. That was killing my back. Don't want to die and ruin my back over uh, some MetaZoo cards. You know, they are cool. Here we go. I think this is a good view. Oh shit, this is actually one of my favorite cards. Jackalope, I have a Jackalope hat. And uh, Gold Pops McGee has a Jackalope mounted on his wall. Jackalope's a super cool animal. Hell yeah, foil version, I didn't have that. Hell yeah. This is a great box so far, guys. Boxes are uh, pretty cheap right now. I got this one for about 40 bucks. And I'm gonna probably get a couple more. Here we go, Spook Light. Ooh, what do we got here? A Wampus Cat. A reverse foil Wampus Cat. Okay, Big Bird. Not like the yellow guy from Sesame Street though. March along. We open up more, more MetaZoo. Here we go. Might split this into two parts, who knows? Hiding in thickets. What do you guys prefer? Should we go over, I guess we don't need to go over all the uncommons and commons and kind of can just jump to the, the pulls, but let's rock. Maybe I'll fan them out. How do, Here we go. Camouflage potion. Okay. It's opposite of what I just said. Go oh, the Chibi Bigfoot. We got the reverse version. Hell yeah, guys. Look at that. We got the Chibi Bigfoot in that one. The foil and the reverse foil. Or hollow, as they say. Hollow or foil, you, I kind of use them interchangeably, but you know, some people, I think they're officially called hollows though. Iowa Dragon, foil, hollow, whatever I was just saying, I don't even know, contradicting myself over here.
lizard people. There's lizard people out there. They're mostly in politics, though. Ooh, I like this card. I haven't seen that one. Well, this one's cool, too. Oh, all right. A haunted tundra. Full foil. Look at that. It's neat. Okay, just going through this. Alien intelligence. They're out there. Okay, and a big bird. Okay. Full hollow. I'm going to say we had so much fun already. Pulled so many cool hollows. Oops. So many cool hollows. We already got our $40 worth out of it already. Let's go. Keep going. Well, that's a neat card. The Pink Mess of Goose Creek Lagoon. Next pack. See what we get. We get the black dog. Like the one from uh, Martha's Vineyard. I had a paper out and dogs used to try to chase me and stuff. It's not fun. Let's see. A big bird again. Okay. We got a big bird in a reverse. So now we got a big bird in a regular, in a hollow, full, and a hollow reverse. We ain't getting no alien yet, but we're working on it. Little green man, little green man, we're working on it. Okay, Scorching Rod Sigil. Sigil. I do have that one already. And once I'm done with this, I always take kind of my couple favorite cards and I'm gonna go send those off to CGC to go get them graded most likely Rose Robinson a person Anti-potion potion. Okay. It's an oxymoron or a contradiction. Frozen spirit sigil. I like that one. Okay, we're getting down, getting down to it. We're just breezing through this, having a blast. Having a blast like Frosty the Snowman, the friendly snowman. Black dog again. We got that. We got a double. No Wild 7 yet, I don't think. Let's see. Pasquela River Aliens. Iowa Dragon. A big bird. We've gotten a few of these now. I would also like a unicorn. I have a reverse unicorn, but that's one of the cooler cards from the set as well. I forgot to mention previously. Let's see. Wampus cat. Reverse. Have four or five packs or something left. Who's counting? Not me, that's for sure. Heck yeah, a token sitter. Okay, Meta Zoo. Partially open pack. Does that mean it's going to be extra good or extra poop? Heat Wave. I haven't seen that one yet. Rocky. Rocky Balboa.
We got that green clawed monster. We haven't got a full foil in a little bit. Does that mean this one is gonna have one? I feel it will. Oops. I feel it will have one. Let's see. My intuition is correct. Or oh, yeah, it's wrong. We got another big bird. Shit, big bird. Let's get another, let's get something else. Rose Robinson, that's a neat one. Haunted Tundra. Two packs left, what is it gonna be, folks? Nervous, nervous as a bumblebee over here. Pink Goose Wild Lagoon. Last pack, last pack look. Okay, and we got a dupe. We got two dupes at the end. The last two were not last pack luck. It was two, two uh, the same. That's what I'm trying to say. Would we get golden hair girl, jackalope? We got the chibi Bigfoot. That was probably our best pull. And the Iowa Dragon was our, our other good best pull as well. Um, and they were all kind of good pulls. I mean, they were all rare pulls. Look at that. They were all rare cards. What do you guys think? I give it a an eight, seven or eight out of ten for for pulls. Ten out of ten for fun. So until next time, fellers and ladies, I bid you adieu.